Hi, I'm Dave Kempster and I'm product manager for TRVs at Drayton and this is the famous Drayton TRV4. It's an iconic design and we've been manufacturing this product in our factory in Plymouth for over 25 years. In this video I want to tell you a few things about the TRV4 that you may not already know. Firstly, the range limiting pins. The TRV4 has a wide temperature range, all the way down to frost at 8 degrees up to a maximum position of 30 degrees. But that may be too much. In public spaces or perhaps in children's bedrooms you might prefer to allow a maximum temperature of 4. You do that by adjusting the range limiting pins which are found inside the, the TRV4 head. The range limiting pin is this pin on the right and you can lift that out. To limit the temperature range to a maximum of 24 degrees, firstly turn the head to frost, insert the pin into position number 4 and then we have a TRV which is limited to a maximum of 24 degrees. Secondly, the non-stick valve. The plastic insert inside the valve it avoids line scale in hard water areas so you can be sure at the start of the heating season the valve will open. And lastly, the balancing key which can be used with Drayton's TRV4 to swap out gland seals at the top of the insert and also to set a flow rate allowing you to balance the radiators. To remove the upper gland seal, use this end of the balancing key and insert in the two holes at the top of the seal and unscrew. So use the presetting key to insert the new gland seal. You can do this under system pressure, just put a towel underneath in case there are any drips and then screw the gland seal down until it's flush with the top of the insert. To balance the radiators you need firstly to unlock the insert. You use these four pins on this side of the balancing key and turn by 180 degrees. To change the flow rate, turn the insert by using the two pins on this side of the presetting key. It's applied in position six uh, which is read off at the top of the key and turning it like this I've turned it to position one which is the smallest flow rate. When you're happy with the flow rate remember to tighten up the white locking ring. So I hope you've enjoyed learning a few things about the TRV4. If you'd like to know more sign up to our 9 degree network and access our online training academy.